today I'll be showing you how I film, edit, and produce my YouTube videos. Let's just jump into it. Okay, so the first thing I do is plan. The reason I plan is so I get a clear idea of what my video is going to be, and it makes it easier to film. And I don't write every single detail here. I just write key points and things I might need to reference throughout the video. Okay, so after I plan, I get my filming gear ready. So I mainly use a Gorillapod tripod in my phone. And I also use this big tripod sometimes. Oh yeah, and that top-down shot was filmed using this tripod. Okay, so now to film. When I film, I mainly focus on three main things. Camera angles, lighting, and slow-mo and time-lapse. Here's how I use them. Auto one to three, high up in the air, something like Mazzanita. I see no sea. Okay, so I first find a camera angle I like and set up my camera there. Then I adjust my lighting to make it more ambient. And I also adjust some settings on the camera. So once I'm happy with the setup, all I do is hit record and I have a super cinematic shot. I really like these cinematic shots and I use them in a lot of my other videos. Okay, another type of shot is these close-up shots of me drawing. And to do that, I set up my tripod and I open my window so I get more lighting and it makes the shot more clean and bright. The final thing I like to use is slow motion. Slow-mo shots are my favorite shots to get because, I don't know, it just looks cool. I also feel like it helps slow down the video and makes it have a better pace, I guess. And uh, yeah, I think focusing on these things makes the filming better. Now for my favorite part. Yeah, when I blow up, I'm a sore high like Peter Pan. To edit, I don't use my computer, I use my phone. And I use an app called CapCut Video Editor. CapCut has a lot of awesome tools I can use, and you can see I've been working on this video right now. The steps of my editing go something like this. I first import all my clips, then add my music. I also make some cuts. After that, I add effects and transitions. Then color grade. And last but not least, add my voiceovers. It's a lot of steps, but it really improves my videos. After a long time of editing, I finally export my video. Then I go to Photoshop to make a quick thumbnail. And after that, I go to YouTube and make a title for my video. I also write a description. Then I just change some settings and we need one love to free us from the hatred going stronger. Division growing wider. Lovers turn into fighters. Think we on a downward spin. We need one love, one love. We need one love.